I bet Daddy's embarrassed to have to drag you around. Boy, I bet you're wondering why we're starting off in the middle of a fight. Shut up! Shut it out! Focus! The data was corrupted, boy. So I had to start again for the last save. Oh, that was close. So full disclosure, I have already been these two, um, but like I said, the data was corrupted, so I had to go back from the last save. It's a whole thing, man. I'm gonna have to redo it, but it is what it is. Can you chill with that? Nah, so he's down now, it's just this one. I feel like that big brother is a lot easier to take out and handle. The other one's got a lot more tricks I can see. Too slow. So ignore that bro, he's a prick. Release the hounds, boy. Weak ass headbutt. Okay, chill with the Harry Potter stuff. Out of the way so I can beat you better. Than Go down. That's enough of that. I 
Waffen an. Not this again! Sick, he needs Freya. No, steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine. See, boy, I told you vaping is for dweebs. Now, look at you. We should keep an eye on it. With that, we can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. You killed Meg. That he did. Carved him off like a Christmas but turkey boy. Minor Aesir, perhaps, but I. In his father's store. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. Aw oh, man, there was a heap school fight here to like Thank destroy you, them and then things came out, we got to kill him. <sighs> Corrupted data. Yeah, I put an axe to his forehead. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Montage boy.
book. Get back near the giant's head. What? What is this place? Fisherman would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit on the other side. Useless boy can't even kick a chain down. That's not a rope. <laughs> so it's, it's a chain. The boy's mind must be too far gone from the sickness. Under his palm. We're almost there. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Wrote a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? That you have come a long way. Thanks. She'd probably also say, What have you done for me lately? What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Jotunheim, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak, and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple. Submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. It seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Hey, Mimir. Last we were in a boat, you had just started the story. What did you want to tell me about the Long War? Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? <clears throat> Precisely. Enough was enough, and at last Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Story time's overhead, boy. Find that magical law. Wow. I can't believe we're setting foot in Tears Vault. Another one of these. There's something over there. It's Tear, but. The middle panel is easy. Wait, I thought Tyr was a god, not a giant. 
Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. No, this is just really boring. You smell something. Yeah, I do. It smells like... Yeah, I ripped ass. Rain? You ruined everything. I am that fucking hammer. But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Because Magni's gone. Won't be a joke. But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! <laughs> you don't know anything about my mother. Oh, it's true. But I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother. Right after I finish killing your father! Oh! Whoops! I think I broke him! <laughs> oh. No! That's how it's done, Stay boy. Back. to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Eye is on you, brother, especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Freya's forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move, and if anyone can heal him, it's hard. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god, but a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. the serpent. The fever burns hotter. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Freya! Open the door! Open we need your help! No, Fre <laughs> Woman, do Open you hear me? No, Freya. It is urgent! Open the door. I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! He is 
Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm. Hell. The realm of the dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding cold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the nine realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up the past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Hey, Malay. You must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Lee. As you wish. Everything I see reminds me of boy. Boy. Ow. Oh yeah, this seems useless again, so we're gonna... oh.
I don't even need to rage. I think I got the hang of this, we got this. Nah, you stay out of it. There's nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> You cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. 
See where those blades come from. Oh, baby, I haven't used these things in a long time. Yo, that is like a finger workout. <laughs> as much as that works, and it's a huge finger workout, man, it's a lot of fun. Ah yes, those blades will serve quite well in hell. Now I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there, in your own front yard no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? foreign magic sweet nana's nethers what are those i've never seen the like that's got to be a family heirloom no nor will it ever be son my brother and me created me all near for the big idiot i know from quality and them them special hey where's the little turd he has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Well, we all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help him? I can do things. And what I should tag along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. I'll be uh, I think I'll end it here. Pick it up next time.